We're about to take a ride on the Dollywood Express. Cinderella. To see the Christmas lights. Hey everybody. Hello. We are back at Dollywood here for Dolly's Smoky Mountain Christmas. Mm -hmm. Last time we were here, we weren't able to ride the train because it was the first opening night. It was so busy, mm -hmm. but it's the first year that they're gonna have some kind of light display on the train loop. Yep. So we're back to check that out. Yeah, the train only runs every hour here at Dollywood, so if you wanna spot on the train, you gotta get here early because the lines are very, very long. And obviously you wanna be able to be on the train when it's dark, but luckily it gets dark at 5.30 p.m. Yeah, now. And it is a chilly <laughs> night here in the Great Smoky Mountain. As you can tell, us yes. Florida girls are we, all bundled up. I don't know if we're going to be ready for this winter. It's going to be our first winter here. Mm -hmm. But anyway, so a little bit about the train. Um, it uses 5,000 pounds of coal today. Yes, the coal fire train engine. Real coal. 5,000 pounds of water. Gallons of water. Gallons of water. There you go. And it takes about 5,000 passengers every day. Every day, 5,000 passengers. Crazy. That's pretty crazy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So uh, let's go take a ride on the Dollywood Express. I hope it's gonna be beautiful. I think tonight it's Cinderella. Cinderella! We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RVTV. K and E RVTV. Sing it with us. Sorry, since it's nighttime, it is very dark here at Dollywood. We're just shining by the light of the Christmas lights, but we are so excited to take a ride on the Dollywood Express today and show you all the Christmas lights from the train and the Christmas lights that they have out there for the first time this year here at Dollywood. This is Cinderella. She's a real coal fire engine. You do have the possibility of even getting coals in your eyes on the train. Yes, we've had that so, happen to us. Yeah, be prepared for that. Don't rub your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, make sure you get here early to ride the train. These Christmas lights here by the train are absolutely beautiful. Waiting to get on. You ready for a Smoky Mountain train ride? I'm so excited. <laughs> Hopefully it was worth the wait. It's freezing. <laughs> We've got our Canada hats on. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, great job, great job. Thank you all so much as we get ready to take our train ride and then here the Smoky Mountains. Christmas time here at Dollywood. Engine number 70 is a genuine coal fired steam engine. She will spew out genuine coal soot and cinders. So please protect your eyes as well as the eyes of your children. If you do happen to get a cinder in the eye, try not to rub that affected eye. Simply cover it. Wait till we get back to the depot like right here, right now. Talk to any of the depot agents. We'll point you toward first aid and safety where they'll carefully remove the cinder for you. And here we go. Here on the last few cars, look over to the left-hand side wave. Goodbye to our depot yeah. master, Brenna. She's down there in the middle of the depot, left hand side, waving goodbye to you. Come on, wave goodbye to her now. Got to be the friendliest train of the day. We'll see you later, Brenda. <laughs> we'll head up here and check out these Christmas lights. We'll be back in about two weeks. Dollywood is going to be the friendliest place. The Smokies have left us on the train to keep it that way. On the count of three, a real out howdy. One, two, three. Howdy! Come on, wave to me and friendly with all these folks down here in town. Come on, wave to them now. Come up on the right hand side. We'll be the Christmas. Put us on a little bit of Christmas music, and uh, Miss Dolly Parton's gonna tell us a story from her childhood, a Christmas story. Wave goodbye to Robin up here at Owen's farm. She's on the left hand side there. Uh -huh. Sit back and relax. You see what I mean? She's got two small wheels in the front, two small wheels in the back, and eight large driving wheels in the middle. Now in 1963, she was retired from the White Man's Yukon Railroad, and then in 1977, she was sold to the East Tennessee theme park.
when I was a little girl, my parents didn't have any money. All the toys that we had were mostly homemade. And my mother, after all the years that she and my dad had been married, never had a wedding ring. He couldn't afford it when they got married. So daddy decided that this was the year that my mother should have a wedding ring. And so he told all of us that we could be in on this gift and what little dabble money he would have spent on us, we let daddy take it to put on mama's ring. And daddy made us all part of it by hiding the ring. And the one that found it was going to get a special treat. I think it was a box of chocolate candy. Anyway, daddy hid the ring. We all looked. Mama had no idea what was going on. One of us fouled the ring. My brother and I fought over who it was. But I know it was me. I guess it's him. That's beside the point. Anyhow, we got the ring. Mama loved wow, it. We were all so very, very happy. And it was then that I realized that the best Christmas gift is not the one that you receive, but the one you give away. So I want to challenge every person out there to give to those who need it. And remember, a gift's not always something you buy. The greatest gift was given to us all. It didn't cost a thing. It was love. It was love. You got plenty of that to spare. So I'll start by sharing mine with you. Hey, I love you. Merry Christmas. myself and my fellow assistant conductor riding on the back of car three and I got Matt back here with me on car seven. We thank you all for riding with us here on the Dollarwood Express. We hope you enjoyed your ride with us. Did everybody have a good time? Woo! Here at Dollywood. Once again rolling back into the deep bar. I need everyone to please stay seated for me. You even have to come to a stop and I'll let you know when it's safe for you to exit the train. I am I'm even colder now after <laughs> riding the train. <laughs> well, it's a little later now as well. The temperature keeps dropping. It's in the low 50s right now. Yes. So we're freezing. It also took us from the moment we got in line waiting until we got off the train about an hour and 42 minutes, you said it was? Mm -hmm, because that's how long the line was. And then the train's only every hour. Yeah. So you end up having to wait a long time if you want to go on this train. Yes. The question was, was it worth it? I was thought it was underwhelming. I mean, we were, you know, looking forward to some like really spectacular, some kind of spectacular light display. Yeah. And it really wasn't much besides, I mean, just going around in the train and seeing the lights that are already throughout the park was very pretty. Yeah. But the special display that um, they were talking about and kind of advertising on their yeah. app was. Yeah. So it was just that little part that was a big loop that you do that the lighting that was on the floor. I'm not even sure how well it came out on camera because it was just like flat lights on the floor, but. It was very underwhelming. Yeah, didn't really have a Christmas theme. I mean, the colors a little bit. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I'm kind of disappointed, especially after waiting over an hour. Yeah. But, I mean, we still enjoyed the train always, and seeing the lights around the park was still beautiful. Yes. I'm not going to say I'm disappointed, but underwhelmed for sure. Yeah, underwhelmed, but just with that part that they advertised that was brand new this yeah. year. It wasn't we were hoping it. for a little more, or at least, you know, thinking it was going to be a little more than it was. 
But we always have a great time at Dollywood, and mm -hmm. this um, festival will be running until January 1st. Yep. And there are fireworks on Friday and Saturday nights, weather permitting right now because it's so dry. They canceled the fireworks last weekend for the first weekend. So I'm not sure if they're going to be going on this weekend or not. But then after Christmas, they're going to have a New Year's display with the fireworks until the New Year. Yeah. So maybe we'll be able to come back and see both if, again if the fireworks are permitted. But we still had a great night. We did have some treats. We didn't show you on camera, but we had the um, pot pie funnel cone, which yep. was really, really good. Yeah. And then I tried the three bean chili with cornbread topping. It wasn't very good. It was a very small portion, and the chili itself, there wasn't much going on. And then the cornbread topping was just crumbled up cornbread. So, yeah, wasn't great. But her pot pie cone was delicious. So delicious. Highly recommend buying the tasting pad. Yes, we finished that. ours off. <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess we'll walk around and show you the, some more Christmas lights yeah. on the way out. Let's do it. This tree is so beautiful. I love it. It's I like a it so bright much. yellow oh color. It's a little twinkling little starburst so up there. We're so we're a little sweet. late here at Dollywood now, so the people have kind of cleared out, which yeah. is fantastic. We haven't seen this empty it in is. a long time. <laughs> the opening night was last Saturday. Now today is Wednesday. Yep. So we wanted to come during the week to make sure we got on the train. The weekend, the wait's probably going to be even worse. Yep, I guarantee it. So just be prepared if you really want to ride the train. But you got to get there pretty early. I love this whole area over here. I mean, the lights are just kind of like orange and white, but it's just so pretty. Everything's so pretty. I love all the buildings lined with the white lights. Dollywood it's definitely is magical. Like number one Christmas celebration too. Yeah. Which our favorite SeaWorld. Yes, SeaWorld sea <laughs> has an amazing Christmas celebration. It's like definitely our favorite, even over Disney. And you know we're Disney people. But yeah, it's still really beautiful here. We love the park, all the treats. Last time we were here, we had um, a waffle ice cream sandwich that was dipped in chocolate and then covered with Let's peppermint. Let's go get another one. If it wasn't so cold, I wanted something hot. I did make some yummy soup last night, so we're gonna enjoy that for dinner when we get home. But yeah, Dollywood is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Do you love this big, beautiful tree they have? Gorgeous. Oh, hello there. I like we your hat. We do have a video from opening night here if you're interested in seeing everything here for Dollywood Smoky Mountain Christmas. So check that out. I'll put it in the description below. Good job, Kim. So here is the chicken pot pie bread comb that Kim got that was so, so good. Um, the location where we got the chili, we passed it already, but I don't, I suggest not getting it because it was a tiny portion and it wasn't very good. I love all the decorations over here by the Reds Drive-In. And for those of you who don't know, Red's Diner was where Dolly had her first store-bought hamburger. So that's why there's a Red's here at Dollywood. What'd you learn about the Pines Theater? The Pines Theater, I don't remember, what did Was I learn? Was her like, first performance or something? Oh, her first live performance was at the Pines Theater in Sevierville. So that's why this a Pines Theater here as well at Dollywood. Cinderella's hollering. She is. She's, it's her last ride of the night. Oh, we got our little reindeer. We hung out with them the other night with JB in the Hills. Amazing people. If you don't know their channel, definitely check them out. They do a lot in the Smokies and a lot of Elvis. If you're into Elvis. Wow, this is so pretty. Hold on, I'm going to zoom in on here. I love, I like love pink the pink trees. Teal. Yeah. That's Dolly's closet. Get some apparel in there. But then there's these beautiful crystal trees over here. We're gonna go check them out on Look our how way empty out. It is. The park's not even closed yet. Yeah. How do you recommend coming during the week if you can? Yes. And I would say maybe aim for the 845 train ride too. Yeah. If you can be here that late because yeah, I think you're guaranteed to get on yeah. and stay that late. At least during the week. So pretty. I just love how the light twinkling. And it looks like crystal snow. So beautiful. Have a holly dolly Christmas. Christmas! Christmas! It's the best time of the year! Thank you, Dolly! Will there be snow, Kim? What? Will there be snow? Or we can have a cup of moonshine at least. <laughs> have a holly dolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. 
Oh by golly, have holly dolly Christmas this year. <laughs> Dollywood is so pretty with the Christmas lights, how they're just all symmetrical and straight lines and gorgeous. I love these bells hanging up above. It's really beautiful. Aaron, did you have an awesome night here at Dollywood? I had a really good time. We always have fun at Dollywood, yeah. no matter what time of year, but Christmas is a little extra special. It is, it is. And on the train, they play like lots of Christmas music and stuff like that too. A lot of Dolly singing Christmas music. Oh, so and she really tells fun. she tells a Christmas story on the train as well, which that yeah. was really nice. Really touching. I recorded it. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. I don't know if it'll be made it in the video or not, but it was really, really cute. Yeah, we definitely enjoyed the train. Just, again, this the new display that we, you know, read about was underwhelming, but we still had a great time. Mm -hmm. Dollywood is awesome. Always. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit your like button, hit your notification bell, and if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. That means so much to us. And happy holidays. We will see you in the next episode. Have a holly jolly Christmas. Have a holly dolly. Holly dolly Christmas. You're special. <laughs> Good night, y'all. Bye. -bye.